Hi Sagittarius, it's Elle here to do your June 2018 general reading. Uh, we'll start off with love and then we'll jump into career and finance. The messages will not resonate with every Sagittarius that views the video, but if it does resonate with you, comment below. Um, you might be going through the same thing another Sagittarius is going through. Um, subscribe to the channel, it's much appreciated. I'll save the announcements to the end. Thank you for the love messages for Sagittarius. We're going to do a five card um, advice spread for Sagittarius. Five cards. All right. The first card is you, right where you are. All right. Are you on your correct path is the next card. These two wanted to come out together. What is your main obstacle? What's helping you? How can progress be made? Bottom of the deck, the tower. All right. So the tower shows up when something is um, built on a... Something needs to, you know, be shaken. Something needs to come down. Something needs to... Be disrupted. Uh, you know this. It's been going on for a while. Now the universe has to come in and, you know, be interesting. You know, uh, sometimes it's sexual energy too. Uh, typically, between two people who, by social and uh, moral value and code should not be engaging in sex you know, if you're married partnered whatever and you're outside of your partner I don't know why I felt the need to say that to you I never say that to any other sign never I've never said it something around sex Somebody finds out something uh, explosive, like uh, that someone likes another sex, uh, same sex. They weren't aware of it. Anyway, let's go. You, right where you are, Knight of Swords. Um, you could be rushing in. Like I said, you, you find out something or somebody finds out something. Could be an air sign, finds out something. Could be you. Now you're confrontational. You, you, you've yielded the sort of truth of your truth. So you're going to come in and give someone a peace of mind here. Uh, are you on your correct path? The high priestess with the empress. Wow. Abundance, abundance, abundance. And heightened spirituality and clarity in, in, in the realm of, you know, spiritually. Um, lots of major downloads. Like, write your dreams down. Be cognitive of your dreams. Um, try to keep a dream journal. Synchronicity. It's just heavenly signs here. Some of you are on your right path toward a particular person. Male or female. Typically, of course, the Empress is female. Very abundant, attractive, beautiful, inside and out. Um, creative. She sits on her own throne that she made in the midst of wilderness. In the midst of, of nothing, she created a whole lot of something. Sits in, in control of creativity, in control of life, period. This could be you, too. Someone could be looking at you like the Empress is Sagittarius. And you could be very highly intuitive. Which Sagittarius are? Uh, what is your main obstacle? Five of Wands. Um, ego. Indecision within yourself. Petty arguing outside of self. You could be dealing with another fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius. Leo, what's helping you? Wow, the Ten of Wands. 
at the Ten of Wands, you're, you've either laid the burden down or you're at the brink of you like con you've been contemplating laying it down. You're at the brink of just letting it go. So you're 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 at either one of those. You know, you're gonna you've already laid the burden down, whatever the burden may have been. Um or you're almost there. This man carries these sticks in the most awkward way, right in front of him. You put a burdensome situation in in front of you. You didn't put you first. Hmm. How can progress be made? Ace of Cups. Yes, get back in love with yourself first. Uh, get spiritual guidance here. Get in control of your emotions. Love for self. What is the Ace of Cups? What is the Ace of Cups? Cups. Mm -hmm. Three of Swords. So that's, this is a divorce due to infidelity. The need to practice caution in a relationship. And then the death card popped out. Um, yeah. Just separation. Okay, I'll, I'll take them. Eight of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles. The Magician. Eight of Swords. Two of Cups. So for some of you out there... You just put in a Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus person feels like they put a lot of work into a situation. They were trying to manifest something good here, something solid. Uh, but it didn't turn out in the best manner. And, and now they feel stuck. Either you and or the other person you're dealing with. Because you found love somewhere else, Sagittarius. Possibly with a Cancer Pisces Scorpio. Some of you could be divorcing a Scorpio. You need to have love for yourself. Have separation from a Scorpio. There could be another woman or another man here. An air sign is moving away from the reading. Um... Yeah, it's so many different variables. If you're dealing with Capricorn Virgo Taurus, they might be willing to work on it. Air signs, if you're dealing with Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, they feel stuck. Maybe because you found someone else. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio in particular, you may be contemplating divorce and or separation. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, for some of you, there's love here. Something is shaking up a foundation. And we have a Ten of Pentacles here. Somebody even manifested this shake up. The magician sits in the middle of this. Like they, they, like they were hoping that it was heavy intent. That's what manifesting is. Heavy intent toward a shake up, a breakdown. Sometimes you can do that mentally. You know, if you're in a situation and you're like, man, I just wish I could just get out of there. I just wish I... And you do this all day, every day. You wake up in the morning wishing how you can get out of. The universe comes in and helps you out of or helps the situation along. Let's do career and finance. Sagittarius, this has been a messy situation for you for a while in love. Like, you're going to get it together. All right, career and finance. Career and finance messages for Sagittarius. True, accurate messages for Sagittarius. That didn't turn out well, did it? All right, 
Career finance for Sagittarius. Career finance for Sagittarius. Career, career finance. Okay. Two cards in the same position. Career finance for Sagittarius. Career finance for Sagittarius. Bottom of the deck, four of spades, talks about um, recovery, illness, separation, the need to rest, rest your brain, rest your mental. You right where you are, the ten of club in the playing cards deck. This says unexpected money, unexpected good luck. Are you on your correct path? Two of spades. Ten of hearts. So it looks like for some of you, you feel like you're not. Or there's a question of, there's a decision to a spade and then a ten of hearts. Maybe something you have to make a choice around surrounding your happiness, your home life, something you've already established. Um, you have to make a decision. Maybe it has something to do with an Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. What is the main obstacle? The Six of Diamonds. Six of Diamonds in the playing card deck talks about problems in a second marriage or second relationship. doesn't have to be second, but it does talk about second. Problems exist here. There's an inequality here. So um, this is your main obstacle. The problems in your marriage, which are probably affecting the uh, equality in all aspects, money, you know, emotional, mental, all, physical, all of that. Uh, what's helping you? The tennis space and ending. You need to mentally lay down this burden. Um, maybe an Aquarius, Gemini, Libra in something with you. But that's helping you. Eight of Hearts. How can progress be made? This talks about, in a tarot, it talks about walking away. Uh, walking away from a situation that seemed pretty good from the outside someone looking in from the outside playing cards deck talks about visitors in your home being invited to an event maybe this is how progress can be made you have to enact date night and date each other all over I know it's supposed to be career and finance but um it looks good for if you're talking about finance it's unexpected money here Okay, what's what is this ten of spades? I think your money is tied to um, a long-standing relationship and or a marriage, so that's why we're getting okay. Five of Hearts, hesitating before making decisions. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Two of Hearts again, Two of Cups in the last spread, a successful relationship. Nine of Hearts, you're wishing for either Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. You want success, marriage with this person. Uh, there's also success in business too um, and helping your business here with the six of clubs maybe you're wi wishing for a successful business partnership with someone you're hoping and wishing for that the five of spade you don't get this success without cancellation without heavy arguing there's a third party involved here um, the King of Diamonds, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, and then the Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, particular uh, Cancer here or this Queen of Hearts. It's like some of you are in a marriage, trying to get to a water sign, or you're either married to a water sign and trying to get to another sign, Earth sign, Air sign, or vice versa. You're married to an Earth sign. A fire sign like your or water sign like yourself or you're trying to get married to earth sign trying to get to a water sign or vice versa married to water sign trying to get just out of it okay let's get some cards of advice three cards of advice for Sagittarius your money is tied up in this marriage, you wonder what it looks like to walk out 
you are stronger than you know. Yeah, some of you don't feel like you can do it. Changing your mind. Get some rest. We see that there with the four of spades. Some of you are changing your mind. Keep the faith. Realizations and epiphanies with that high priestess and the empress. Uh, you're stronger than you know. You might be changing your mind about a certain situation. Maybe business. Maybe love. You need to get some rest. Rest your mind. You're not resting. So you're not making the best moves and the best um you're not having the best thoughts for yourself not really thinking things clear you know through so clearly because you need rest you need to sleep sagittarius if this resonated with you please like share comment subscribe to the channel it's much appreciated thank you for tuning in take advantage of the 20 dollars special 20 dollars for three questions three clear questions uh, of what you would like to know by way of the of the tarot or playing cards deck. Um, follow me on Instago. All everything you need to know about me or how to get in contact with me is below. My website is still down. I um, need to make some changes with that. I will get it back up. If you want a reading, just email me. Email address is below. Remember, when in doubt, pray. I am praying for you. Pray for me as well. I'll see you in mid-June. Take care, guys.